know this has been fast, but I just wanted to get this one out of the way. Today, I'm recapping SH Monster Arts Destroyer Special Color Version. This is my third ever Monster Arts I've ever gotten, and one of the first biggest ones that I got. Second being King Ghidorah, and then Biolante. And I keep him uh, mostly in the stand by himself. But I mostly display him with Mecha Godzilla because he's the only one who can actually fit in the display case right next to him. But without further ado, let's get right into the review. So, I have Destroyer out now. And the only reason I picked up this version is because unlike the original where it had like red eyes, red eyes, this one actually looks like the actual film because of the yellow. Plus the um the yellow horn, but I didn't know if it was translucent or not. Anyway, I like the darker tone given to his given to his head than the original the original red. Mostly around his body too. But I like to say this thing did have a flaw when I got him out for the first time. I think it was either this one right here. It was off the it was disconnected and it was a pain in the ass to get it back on. And his tails don't line up. The two close, one's too far apart. As you can see, it's this one right here. But it's just, it's just a minor nitpick. But unlike that, he's pretty articulated. I think um, when I had display on my display case, it looked like he was slunched over to his right a little bit but i didn't know if it was just my eyes playing trick on me oh and also unlike this arm that's like to stay up this art just slumps down that's why i keep his wing right here to keep him support up even though that might chip away but these are just little minor nitpicks um his so articulation's pretty good. I don't keep him like this. I mostly just keep him like this though. Because I don't really meh. Because in my display case, there's not much room to um, do anything. Do any poses or anything. But, enough being said, let's bring out some other of my bigger figures and we'll do a size comparison. So, I got King Ghidorah here. The original release. And thank god mine doesn't have like Bro, my necks don't disconnect on this thing. And my and the special color version of Iolente here. Because I am not getting the original. That thing is way overpriced on eBay. And Amazon. He he's really big he's really big. Scaled to Biolante. Actually these two are supposed to be the exact same height. Well King Ghidorah is supposed to be 150 meters tall. But with his accessories that he comes with, I think he's a decent figure to pick up, even though mine was way overpriced to get up to get him. He came with the little maser tanks, but I kinda like it. I pose, I pose them with Godzilla or Mecha Godzilla. But what do you guys think? Comment down below. Is this figure worth getting? And tell me if it is or if it isn't. Anyways, see you soon. This is Baggonzilla95. And out. Peace.